What's going on, everybody? Rage Devonian in here, bringing you back another episode of Pokemon Sword. It has been a while since we have been here, but then again, I have been a breeding machine trying to make some teams. I've got a lot of mons. Um, this is our this is a singles team that I used in the online tournament, and this is our doubles team. We've got Banded Fish, Life Orb, Pult, Focus Sash, Pelipper, Assault Vest, Ludi. Iron Fist, Black Belt, uh, not Guts, to um, Toxic, or Flame Orb, Conk, and we've got a bulky Rotom Wash set to complement the rain. Um, as you'll be able to see here in a sec, my record is not too good. I am still pretty bad at online battles. I'm learning the VGC, I'm trying to get good on the ladder best I can. Um, but it is definitely a learning curve for sure. Alright, let's see. We've got Flygon, Conk, Lucario, Togekiss, Weezing, and Lapras. Lapras is a huge problemo. Um, we are going to need Rotom for sure to just take that thing down. Um, how do we want to lead here, though? I think the best lead that we could do is um, Fish, Dragapult in the back. Dragapult is our secondary rain setter. It's got Hydro Pump. We can max Geyser. And then we want Rotom in the back. We can burn the Lucario and Conk and make them and hinder them, uh, assuming the Conk is not Guts. And then we can bring Rotom and yeah, yeah, we have, I mean, we'll bring Ludi in the back to wall a lot of to wall the so special attackers with the assault vest. And then I can also Giga Drain the Lapras. I can double into it with Thunder Giga Drain and get rid of it. So I think that's how we're gonna play this one out. Again, I'm not really sure how this is gonna work, but. We've got our electric gym leader look on. Yes, I have done. I finally customized my character. Denver did it in the Let's Play, but we're doing it now, and that's all that counts. Oh, we are battling in the battle. Okay, and he leads the Lapras. Alright, this is a little bit of a problem. Um. Will a rain boosted Ficious Ren take it out? If I double into it with Ficious Ren Max Geyser. Or do I just... Maybe I just go straight Rotom here. If I go Rotom in the place of Vish, and then Max Geyser into the Togekiss. Just in case this Lapras wants to protect. We're going to Max Geyser into the Togekiss. That way we'll have rain set up so we can just thunder the absolute crap out of this Lapras. We're getting big. We are getting big here, folks. That is a big boy. Togekiss uses follow me. That's fine. Oh, that is damage. This is definitely not a bulky Togekiss set. And the freeze dry pops off on the Rotom. We should eat that fine. I mean, not as fine as I would have hoped, but... Alright, I think... Let's get a little bit more lefties recovery here. By protecting the Rotom, and then... Let's just max Geyser again, since now it's rain boosted. He doesn't have Storm Drain on his side of the field, so... That's fine. I was targeting down that Togekiss anyways. I think we put ourselves in a pretty good spot here. 
Togekiss is down. It has done nothing for him. Freeze dry into the Rotom. Beautiful, beautiful. Alright. Bring out a physical attacker. Weezing. Alright, it is a Levitate Weezing. And we are going to just... Um, double into the Lapras here. Because I think we get rid of the Lapras, we should be A-OK. -okay to just go ham with Ludi. We'll drop the defense on the Weezing. That will ensure us a Fischius Ren knockout. Alright, the Lapras goes down. I'm Dynamaxed. I have taken a lot of Life Orb damage, but I should live this at... Yeah, easy. Easy peasy. We'll get off another attack with Dragapult as well. Rotom is back above 50%. We are sitting real good here. And Flygon is the last Pokemon. So I have Ice Beam on Ludicolo and Fake Out Pressure, so honestly I am not worried about that thing at all. We are just going to... Am I scared of the... I have Levitate, so I'm not scared of a Ground-type attack either. He might be physical. Should we burn it? Let's burn it. We'll hinder it. We'll make it useless, and then we'll protect the Dragapult. Let's see. What, let's just see what he wants to do here. I mean, he can still get big. Okay, he is physical, but we block that with protect. Let's hope we land this Will-O-Wisp, and we do. Okay. All right. So we have hindered Flygon. Strange Stream gets launched into Rotom. We eat that. J oh, we need gets the confusion. <sighs> well, we did eat it fine. All right, we still have a turn of rain. Yes, yes. All right, so we're just gonna go ahead and thunder into the Weezing and Shadow Ball into the Weezing. It doesn't look like he wants to protect anything. Oh, this thing must be scarfed. Not ah, even burnt. Well, we had like zero health left. Alright, Rotom. Hit through, please. Hit through. Hit through, Rotom! There we go! Not hacksing me, not today. An aromatherapy comes off. Hmm. Okay, okay. Black Sludge comes off on the Weezing. Alright, let's go Ludi here. Did not know Weezing got Aromatherapy. We've got Fake Out Pressure here, though. The Flygon... Mm, the Flygon's gotta be getting big. Let's go for the Burn on it again. And then let's... No, 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 no. Ah, going Ludi might have been a mistake here. Let's double into the Flygon. I'm not scared of the Weezing. I am right. He's getting big. A if I connect the Hydro Pump and the Ice Beam, though, this thing is not living. Oh, he's getting big with Weezing. Are we seeing a Max Guard? No, we're seeing a Dragon Claw. Rotom goes down. That's fine. We're going to launch off a huge Ice Beam into this thing. Flygon goes down. And Weezing will not be able to take out both Dracovish and Ludicolo. Probably. He does have the Max Ooze. 
we eat that up, dude. Assault vest. And this wheezing is not gonna outspeed me either. Choice banded fish choice band fishius wren that goes first, plus a scald will spell the end for this wheezing. He can max guard and try and stall all he wants. It is not going to work though. I guess I could have faked out the No. No, faking out the Um, what you call it? The Flygon probably would not have saved Rotom. That's fine though. I we I think we made the right play. Is he going for the double max guard? He has to, I mean. <laughs> He has to get as much HP recovery as he can. Nope, no double max guard. And Ficious Ren takes him down. Dun, dun, da, da, da. We have defeated Koda. I kind of want to just end there on a win. But we should probably do another one. Oh yes, a bottle of PP up. Uh, no, I don't care about checking there. We'll do one more. Said it was gonna take a while for it to update. All right, we are tied at wins and losses. Let's see if we can't push this over the edge. An opposing trainer has been found. Isadora. All right. We've got Obstruct Obstagoon. Huh. I wonder if it's a D Dancing Moxie Gyrodos. All I know is, I want to lead. If the Gyarados lead comes out for Intimidate on, like, Conk, Fish, and Dragapult, because he. A lot of people run physical Dragapult, then I want to lead. Ludi Rotom and just thunder into that. Not Ludi, uh, Pelipper Rotom and just thunder into that Gyarados slot and get it 100% off me. And then for Salazzle, I mean, both Rotom and Pelipper can take care of that. We definitely want Dracovish um, just to do huge damage on anything. And then I think we should bring Conk. Just so we can mock punch things. Mainly the. Mainly the obstacle. And Gengar doesn't have enough bulk. Like, Officious Rand is gonna take it out. I don't have to lock myself into Crunch. Or anything else for that matter. I dropped my controller. That's fine. Alright, alright, alright. Isadora, what is your lead? Grimmsnarl and Sylveon, so we're... Ooh! Look at that! Somebody's fancy. So, screens are getting set up here. Um, let's go ahead for a Tailwind, and then a huge Thunder into this. Which one's more powerful? They're the same. But Thunder can pair. Well, no. Hydro Pump's more powerful because it's in the rain. But Thunder can't miss. Man, we're going for Hydro Pump. Screw it. Oh, T dang it. I would have. I assumed. That was. That's my bad. I assumed Specs Sylveon just because that's the Sylveon that I've seen the most, but that makes sense. Alright, but now I can go ahead and double into this Sylveon without worrying about the Protect, and if it... Since I'm doubling into it, let's go for the non-miss with Hunt Hurricane Thunder. He might just be getting big, and I might just be knocking out his Dynamax Mon here. I don't know if I'll do enough damage. He's got du double screens up. No, I won't do enough damage. That did nothing, dude. No confusion, can I get the paralysis? Sylveon is eating that up, dude. Is 
Z lefty set. Yeah. Alright, so he this Sylveon's all bulk here. Let's go for the protect and let's burn this Grim Snarl. Or burn something that's coming in. And then we'll protect Rotom the next turn. Maybe we'll get some confusion hacks on the Sylveon with Hurricane. We'll stall out his screens. Oh, just going straight for Protect. Alright. Thunder waving into the Pelipper slot. Alright, so we made the right play there. Rotom's getting some help back. So is the Sylveon. I just gotta keep launching attacks into this Sylveon. Let's go for a Hydro Pump, it'll do more damage. Alright, not getting big yet. No confusion. I nail the Hydro Pump. Oh, high roll on the Pelipper. That's unfortunate. Spirit Break, is that a physical move? I think it is. We're gonna eat that up. Alright, a Hydro Pump will take out even if he protects and gets more leftovers. And so... Oh, Tailwind petered out. Dang it. I needed that for fish. That's fine. Alright, let us go into Ficious Rend and Hydro Pump. We'll cover. He's probably going to want to go for a Prankster Thunder Wave here. Alright, I thought he would protect. But it was just in case. He hits the Thunder Wave. I don't know. We're in a pretty bad spot here. That's fine. If I can nail the fishies rain, rain boosted. Reflect up. Rain stops. I need my rain up. That's what I need. Is light screen gonna end? Light screen should end. No, it doesn't. It's got one more turn. Oh, no, 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 no. We're not fishing running into that. We're fishing running into the thing. And we are going to reset our rain here. Withdraws the Sylveon. Goes into the Obstagoon. Oh, we're going to get big damage into this thing. Sylveon's going to come back in when Light Screen isn't up, and that's going to be huge. I don't know if I'm making the right place here. But is everything on his team just bulk? Uh, Light Screen, I guess. That thing cannot take... We're going to eat that up. Does Spirit Break always lower special attack? Was I not paying attention, or did he just get lucky there? Alright, he gets burned by the Flame Orb. Light Screen is... Did I... Oh, no, he doesn't have screens on anymore. I must just not be paying attention over here. It just must be the fact that Rotom has absolutely zero special attack left. I did not know that about Spirit Break. I am not paying attention. So I am not making the right place here. I should have withdrew Rotom and Dynamaxed it after the fact. Withdraws the Grim Snarl. Sends out the Sylveon, probably just to 
sack it off. I mean, a rain boost to Max Geyser is probably gonna. Oh no, a rain boost to Fishes Ren is gonna take it out. Obstagoon's getting big. Goes for the max knuckle. I'm gonna eat that up. Won't eat up the second one though. Green boost and max geyser. It's gonna do not enough. That did nothing. Yeah, I had just not been paying attention. I made the very incorrect plays there, but that's fine. I still have a turn of Dynamax though, right? Went for two max geysers. Alright, we're gonna go. We're gonna max guard on the next turn. So Lazzle's coming out. Uh -huh -huh -huh. Alright, we're gonna get this off skin off the field. So Lazzle, I am not afraid of in the rain. Oh, it's carrying Dragon Pulse? This thing gets Dragon Pulse? Please, yes, thank you. Alright, Dragovish, thank you. Will it die to burn damage is the question. Nope, it won't. Oh, now their light screen is gone. Oh, so the reflect was what the uh, I had I checked my own info. I had to check theirs. Stupid. All right, I'm just I just played dumb this game. This game was definitely very 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 winnable. I just and it, I also needed PP ups on um, on a hydro pump. I guess I didn't really need PP ups on Hydro Pump. Since I, that was taking me out, anyways. Alright, Obstagoon's finally dead. Got the Conk in the back. He's got Grim Snarl. Mock punches Grim Snarl out of here. Prankster goes before Mock Punch? Well, that's the game, man. Fire Blast in the rain. That's not going to do that much. Alright, the rain is now stopped. Okay. I mean, there's still a chance. Let's see how much this hammer arm does with the reflect up. Like, he can miss fire blasts. Like, lots of things can happen here. Oh, come on. We live one. Hammer arm connects. That still does a lot. Hmm. Okay. This game can still be won. No, he's probably just going to go for um, a Dragon Pulse or something that wouldn't miss. Mock Punch crit! Nope. 
yeah. Ah, so close. That game was so winnable. Uh, I just played bad. I was not paying attention to the special attack drops or the screens like I should have. It's so whatever. Reflect wasn't up. Mock Punch went before Reflect. We would have won. Mock Punch would have crit. We would have won. That's fine. Actually, I'm kind of... I need a Scarf Gengar. Leftover Sylveon. Yeah, that thing was bulky. I should have just... Let's see. Spirit Break. This also lo okay, so it it lowers every time. That's good to know. All right. Well, with that, I'm gonna get the hashtag out of here. Uh, I hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe for more. We'll be bringing back VGC um, every once in a while. I don't know how often. I don't know what I want to do with the channel at this point moving forward. Now that Soren Shield's over, but I do know that I want to get better at this and I want to share it with you. And um, so yeah, go ahead, subscribe, ring that bell. Uh, we'll be back with more VGC later all. Take care.